Today I went blacklighting in my backyard. Here's what I caught. I want to record more of the actual process of capturing queens, but it's hard to record when you're doing it. But I did record this Laceus interjectus queen walking around. In total, I caught four Laceus parasites. Two of them have broken off their wings and two of them have not. I desperately need to find host workers for them. I think they are cool looking and I'm fascinated by the idea of social parasite ants. But I'm a relatively inexperienced ant keeper and I've never worked with parasite queens. So I'll either have to buckle down in looking for host workers or find them a home. I wish I could find more ants that I can actually keep well. I also caught two more Campanatus nearcticus or Carrier delates. One of them is kind of smaller than the other, so I wonder if they're different species or if they were just fed differently. I'm happy to have caught two more of these queens. They're kind of like my backups in case the first one I caught has issues. Last year I had one and she made it to hatching her first worker, but she killed it for some reason. I was sad. They don't have the impressive size of a lot of other Campanatas, nor do they have interesting colors, but they're so entertaining to watch. There's a wild colony in my yard that I feed, and it'll be cool to have a colony of my own. I should record some footage of the wild ants that come to my little sugar water dishes. I think that'd be fun. Last but not least, I caught a single Campanata Snellingi queen. I already have two, but having a third one isn't going to hurt me. I often mistake these at first for Campanatus castaneus workers and have to do a double take. I love the two stripes they have on their gasters. So yeah, that was my haul for tonight. I hope you enjoyed watching. Bye!